The NBA on 2K Sports welcomes you to Wednesday afternoon basketball. This is Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg and our sideline reporter David Aldridge. Now the starting group for the visitors. The core of this team all out there. Curry and Thompson in the backcourt with Green at the four. Kevon Looney out there with Andrew Wiggins. And for Miami, Adebayo is out there with Antetokounmpo. Then it's Mitchell. Then it's LeBron James. And it's Lillard in at the one spot. And so the tip off, it's Miami. Passes it to out of bounds. And that's out of bounds. Miami will retain possession. Here's Lillard, and then Lillard slams it in. And for a point guard, Lillard has some hops. Outstanding at knowing when to use them for the dunk. It's Curry outside. Antetokounmpo pulls it in. And he didn't punish them for the weak coverage there, but they can't count on him to continue missing. And Greg, even with teams daring Giannis to shoot from outside, his career three-point percentage stuck below 30%. And still an elite score because of his proficiency at the rim. But it's been said before, if he adds the triple, first he'll be truly unguardable. Miami shooting their first shots from the stripe in this game. Damian Lillard. They throw good. Damian Lillard. And known for being a clutch performer, Dame has his sights set on title. A, a true leader with a winning mindset. He's as solid as it gets from the line. I mean, give him the opportunity. He's cashing in on those. Now here's Thompson. To the paint. Here's Green. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. It goes on Giannis Antetokounmpo. What I appreciate most about Green is his leadership strong vocally on and off the floor that one is off and as good as draymond green has been on the floor this guy will be an all-time broadcaster already a popular podcast great tv studio appearances as well and draymond green the next broadcasting star you've watched his work why is that and kevin i think his basketball iq is incredible and we see that when he plays but he can also vocalize it to the audience and of course Draymond is not afraid to say what he thinks and you love seeing that great mobile one drive a second time and that's what a coach loves to see in a close game just put your head down and make something happen Miller the pass to Autobio Andre Kumbo with the ball now Green defending here's LeBron and James throws it down you know, this is one of the reasons why Giannis's teammates appreciate him, because when they're open, he finds them. And so just over a minute and a half played. Outside curve. Off target from three-point range. It's been a quick start for Miami. Here's Lillard, and Lillard throws it down. Is Dane trying to get in the dunk contest? Looked like it on that incredible finish. Here's Curry. Thompson looking for an opening. Pass to Wiggins. And here's Looney. Wide open look. Outside for Curry. And again, it's the Warriors missing. Here's Miami now. They're on a 10 to 1 run. Here's Mitchell. The kick out to Hunter Kumbo. The pass to James. Tries again. Six to shoot. Mitchell passes to LeBron. Here's Otobio. Well, it was only a matter of time, but they finally get the bucket. Displaying intensity right off the opening tip, especially on the offensive end. Tell you what, forget about easing into the game. They came out with guns blazing. 
Miami leading by 11. James finds Mitchell. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. Excellent all-around performance so far, hence the big lead. Yeah, you know, they've had the advantage at both ends. They've got all the momentum early on. Now let's take a moment to get your guys' take on the scoring so far for Miami. And, guys, they've done a great job feeding their bigs inside. They are just punishing the opposition in the paint. I would like to highlight two guys, the excellent passing they've done early on. I mean, they've done a really good job putting the ball into the hands of guys ready to shoot it. And Miami making a change here. Barnes has checked in. They're really on their heels at this point. Yeah, on both ends of the floor, Kevin. They've lost some confidence along the way. Here's Kuminga, and Kuminga throws it down. And wait to finish and cut into that lead a little bit. Yeah, but look at the, ba the basket guy still shaking. Well, I tell you what, he loaded up as much power as he could behind that two-hander. And Miami has possession. The Warriors making the shot. Jokic kicks to Smith. Even Genzo against Ellis. Yes, and it's Smith with the assist that time. Really seizing the momentum of this game, but doing it with a methodical approach. And, you know, that involves pounding it inside, getting as many points as you can right at the rim. That demoralizes the team. 110 left in the first. Outside, green, a three ball. That shot misses. And it's Miami the other way. It's stolen by Green. Cool against Ellis. No one near Peyton as he lets it go. Buries the long-range jumper. And he's not going to miss that sort of an opportunity from deep. Smith inside. Defended by Kaminga. Here's Green. And Green slams it in. And it's easy to admire Green. His ability to work through contact is one of the reasons he's so valuable. There's 42 seconds left to play in the first. Even Genzo with it. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Barnes with it. Now Peyton defending. Here's Ellis. It's rebounded by Poole. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the game here. First personal foul. Second. Moody's checked in for the Warriors. Moses Moody. There's 21 seconds left in the first quarter. Ellis against Poole. And the lead is down inside single digits. Watch out now. When this guy gets into a rhythm, it is something to behold. And it's Monte Ellis with the finish. Yeah, his court awareness and feel. Jokic is incredible in those areas. I mean, he sees the floor extremely well for a big guy. And here's Poole for three. And so it's Miami holding on to an 11-point cushion as we get ready to take a break. They're playing a bruising game inside, and it's working for them. We've got more in store for you right after this. second quarter of action plenty of basketball left to play but this one has been one-sided so far and let's quickly break down the game we've seen from Miami guys aggressive at running guys to the backboard you could tell it was part of their game plan coming in yeah and you know when a team establishes an edge on the glass early it really sets things up for the rest of the game so with Thompson sitting on the bench here's the group that Steve Kerr has on the floor the pairing up front it's Green and Looney Curry is out there with Moody. And it's Wiggins in at the three. The small four. 
he is single-handedly dropping the temperature in here with that cold streak. And he's got to find other ways to contribute then because his shot making is not happening right now. Here's Autobio. Buries it down low. You know, this is why you run the offense through Damian Lillard. I mean, sure, he's going to get his, but he's also going to make sure others get theirs, too. Now Curry. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. And last season, Bam Adebayo said it was disrespectful that he wasn't named a finalist for Defensive Player of the Year. What do you think? Well, Kevin, no arguing here. He, he's definitely an elite defender. Second team all defense, three years running. Great toughness and versatility. Offensively, defensively, they are in total control. And don't leave out the coaching staff here now. I mean, their game plan has been perfect. Now, here's Green. And Adebayo sends a pick. And got to be careful shooting around Adebayo. An athletic big man who gets up as fast as anybody to block shots. And here's James. He'll bring it up for Miami. Unwilling to let up even for a moment. That's his killer instinct just fanning the flames. Yeah, I love the fact he doesn't play the score. He just keeps coming. Attack mode. He doesn't know how to step off the gas pedal. And it's the Warriors with the ball. 15-point game. Over in the corner, Green. Three-pointer. Connects from three-point range. Green's got five points now this quarter. And great offensive instincts from Green. Goes into the shot the moment he catches the ball. Lillard dishes to Mitchell. And it's Mitchell with the jam. And despite the size disadvantage, attacking the heart of that defense. You know what, guys? Honestly, I didn't think he'd win that battle. I mean, that's a lot of height to give up. Mitchell's gone two or three from the floor. Timeout called the Warriors. <laughs> and the lack of rim protection, top of the list. Yeah, you know, just look at the numbers, guys. I mean, they are being taken to the woodshed in the paint. Kevin Durant's checked in for Miami. And the Warriors also making a change. Clay Thompson, he's checked in for Moody. Down low, here's Thompson, and it's sent back by Mitchell. Here's LeBron. Good, and it's Mitchell picking up the assist. And Miami leads by 16. For all his strength and power, James can also be extremely graceful throwing off the defender with a really nice move there. And it's the Warriors' ball. Curry kicks it to Looney. Thompson outside. Outside, and the Warriors miss again. Even with every shot clanging off the rim, he seems determined to keep hoisting up these three. It might be time to get inside of that arc. Now, here's Mitchell. 16 point lead, the largest margin in the game. Durant, wide open, he fires. Off target with his three. We've got 155 left now here in the second. Pass to Looney. And that one is stuffed right through. And, you know, for a big man, I think Green is one of the better dime droppers in the league. I mean, he's a true point forward who has excellent vision and sees the floor well. Curry against Lillard. This is it to Mitchell. Going inside. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. 
taking it right into the teeth of the defense. And it's a defense that's starting to look frustrated. Well, they should be. I mean, it has not been a good performance for them at that end of the floor. And the Warriors making a change here. Green, he's checked in for Looney. Kaminga comes in for Tremont Green. Dante DiVincenzo, he's checked in for Andrew Wiggins. And Poole subbed in for Curry. We've got 128 left in the first half of the game. Thompson outside from deep three-point range, and it's Miami with the rebound. Here's Lillard. He has six. Even Chenzo with the rebound. Those are chances almost always you can rely on him to get you two points, but the D just enough to keep him out of rhythm. Miami leading by 17. Pass to Autobio. And the shot goes in. Autobio has got six. And inside is where Bam is at his best. He knows how to outwork the other guys in the paint. 52 seconds left in the second quarter. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. The pass to DiVincenzo. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. Here's Miami now. Lillard looking around. James, the pass to Lillard. Kicks it out to Mitchell. Five to shoot. Here's Lillard. Off on the layup. That's the kind of D you need when he's got the ball near the hoop. They were all over. Back to Thompson. Let's the three fly. Trains the three-pointer. Thompson's got himself on the board with three there. I really believe we can go ahead now and lock Clay Thompson in on the short list of the greatest pull-up shooters in the NBA. And we might be talking the all-time list here. And so it's Miami in command with a 16-point lead as the buzzer sounds. They've been playing some inspired defense, giving a very few easy points. And we'll be back with you shortly. Wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. It's been one outstanding game from Donovan Mitchell. He's done a fantastic job of finding open space to operate within the first few quarters. And you know what? It helped that they had a few guys with very hot hands on the perimeter, too. So with Smith sitting on the bench, this is who Eric Spolster has on the floor. They've got out of iron. Mitchell is out there with Damian Lillard. And then there's Antetokounmpo. And it's James in at the small forward position. And one of the many special things about Steph Curry, his loyalty. Sticking with this Warriors franchise since being drafted back in 09. Now here's Lillard. Here's Yuck. And onto Takumbo swings it in. Man, it would be kind of cool to be Giannis for just one game. He makes dunking and getting to the rim look so easy. Ante Dacumbo has gone four for four from the field. Perfect so far. Here's Curry with the three. Hits it from three-point range. Curry's got five points in the quarter. And talking about Steph, he is the face of the franchise. And his loyalty is shown. Steph's been a model citizen, never complains, never causes any issues, willing to work with young teammates. He is the ideal superstar to build around. One of the reasons they're behind is because we haven't seen enough of that. He needs to become a bigger part of the offense. Alert against Curry. And Lillard kicks to LeBron. And he drives in. And stolen by Wiggins. 
Green in the post. And to the Kumbos there. Curry's shot is off. And so it's Mitchell who brings up the ball for Miami. Earlier in the game, they had a 19-point lead. Here's Lillard. And he banks in the lane. Lillard's got eight. And there's such an edge to Lillard's game. Dame doesn't care where he is on the court. He's going to get buckets. And that was another look at the fantastic Mobile One drive that happened a moment ago. And trying to extend this lead, no better way than playing north and south, getting after it. Now, here's Curry. Five points in the game. And the rejection by Anadokounmpo. And new group getting ready for Miami. Jokic has checked in for Bam Adebayo. Green comes in for James. Barnes, he's checked in for Mitchell. And it's Ellison for Lillard. Then for the Warriors, Andre Iguodala has checked in for Looney. Peyton comes in for Clay Thompson. And it's Ty Jerome in for Curry. There's some defense for you. For someone who's as good at shooting the three ball as he is, you, you need a defender who's equally good at guarding against him. Man, these flashy dribble moves of Ellis are a lot of fun to watch. He has no fear at all in pulling him out and putting him on display. And the Warriors with possession here. They trail by 14. Jerome passes to Peyton. Good D by Barnes. And they are really racking up the assists in this one. And their team chemistry is evident. These guys enjoy playing with one another. Boy, he is so dangerous from this area, guys. Even when Giannis is defended tightly, he powers through it. Did the Kumbo has gone a perfect five for five from the field. Three minutes gone now in the third quarter. Here's Green. A shot that time, not on target. And it's Miami the other way. Wiggins against Ellis. Got us a screen on Wiggins. Ellis finds the Kumbo. And the bucket is good. Three point play chance here for him. And Antetokounmpo is, is just fearless. I mean, Defensive hit him, knock him around, really doesn't phase him, doesn't matter. I mean, this guy is determined to get the job done, and he does. Looking at who's out there now for the Warriors. Green, he's checked in for Draymond Green. And Kaminga subbed in for Andrew Wiggins. free throw line, my call would sound like this. Now at the line, Jalen Brown. One. Free throw, no good for Ana de Kumbo. You really have to appreciate and respect the spirit Giannis plays the game with an attitude of joy and unselfishness, a beacon of energy and enthusiasm for his team. They all feed off of him. He's one of the most popular players in the world. Just over three and a half minutes through the third quarter of play now. And there's a whistle that goes on Scotty Barnes. That's his first foul. First timeout called the Warriors. Checked in for Giannis Antetokounmpo. Dante DiVincenzo. He's checked in for the Warriors. Poole comes in for Jerome. 127 left to play in the third. In transition, here comes Miami. Here's Smith. Great D that time from Green. And even three-on-three three break. Here's DiVincenzo. And the rejection by Smith. Green against Peyton. And Green slams it in. And this has to fire Green up. Whenever he dunks it like that, it gets the whole team energized. Fifty nine seconds left in the third. Ellis against Poole. 
shot to stop the run. No good on the shot. A bit long that time. Boy, you can just see the frustration growing on their faces. Nothing going their way. You know, guys, no denying it's been a rough patch here. I think they've got to run whatever is best in their playbook to get a good shot. And that one drops. Ellis has got eight points. And Ellis really, the strength of his game, his forte, is finishing through contact. It takes a lot to knock this guy out of his scoring and comfort zone. 32 seconds left to play here in the third. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions. Right now, they need a basket. And Poole gets it to go. And providing the score, boy, they need it. That stops a 12-0 run by Miami. That'll be a five-second call. Some changes here for the Warriors. Kavon Looney comes in for Green. Since Thompson in for Gary Payton. Kavon Looney. Clay Thompson. Thompson outside. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. And it goes on Draymond Green. And so long and aggressive from there. Thompson knows how to get the defense to foul. That free throw good from Thompson. And the Warriors making a change here. And he makes both free throws. A legendary shooter, Thompson is also a versatile defender who plays with great energy on both sides of the ball. With four seconds on the clock, and Ellis the bucket on the assist by Jokic. Ellis has got six here in this quarter. Big miscommunication on defense. He recognizes it and quickly takes advantage. Boy, the defense looks shell-shocked. I mean, they're on the ropes right now, on their heels. And so it's Miami closing out the quarter with a 20-point lead from the field. They have been outstanding, amazing shooting. That's what has them headed to a blowout. And we've got more in 2K Sports coming your way after this break. And there have been two very different performances from these teams today as we get going in quarter number four. Miami leading by 20, setting the floor for the Warriors. The core of this team all out there, Curry and Thompson in the backcourt with Green at the four. Wiggins is out there with Looney. A high post shot, and good, and it takes a nice bounce off the right iron and down. Mitchell's got the first field goal of the fourth quarter here for Miami. Now here's Green. Outside Curry. There's the pick. On deep. That one no good. And it's Miami the other way. LeBron against Green. Here's LeBron. Green with the block. Green takes great pride in his defense now. He loves the nine shots at the rim and playing bigger than his 6'8 frame would lead you to believe. And so Curry will bring it up for the Warriors. Fires from deep. A three-pointer is right on target. And perimeter scoring, I have to imagine it was a topic of discussion at halftime. Certainly. I mean, they saw a weakness in the perimeter defense and took advantage of it. An elite score demonstrating once again how fast he can fill it up. Ellis has gone six or seven from the field here, getting just about everything to drop. From deep three-point range, another miss by Curry. Miami leading by 23. Here's Mitchell. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. The aggressiveness of Mitchell, willing to take on the entire team to earn that foul. And a look now at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for Miami. The mid-range game has been there for them all game long, and that old-school approach still getting it done in this one. 
you've also got to commend them for how they've attacked the basket. They've been aggressive. They've not settled and have consistently gone at the rim. It's Curry outside, and it's Miami with the rebound. Adebayo's got four rebounds now tonight. The shot by Mitchell, no good. Wiggins surveying the floor. Kicks to Curry. Dishes to Thompson. Over Mitchell. Nice shot by Thompson. And one of the most composed scores we have in our league. Thompson has the poise to make every shot count. Lillard, the pass to Autobahn. And it's Looney with the rebound. Looney's got four rebounds now tonight. Wiggins dishes to Curry. Trying to find Thompson, he gets it to him. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. It's going to be on Bam out of Bayern. And you can't afford to bail out a dynamic shooter like Thompson. He'll make you pay at the line. Pools checked in for Stephen Curry. Frank, we know that Clay Thompson had 941 days between NBA games because of those injuries. But he was using that experience away for good. And Clay announcing with that his family foundation would have a 941 day initiative. Programs to help workers who have suffered career setbacks. Thompson helping others with their comeback. And the basket is good. The main area of emphasis for Wiggins moving forward has to keep knocking it down from the mid range. Pool against Lillard. Green with the block. Wiggins outside. Thompson in the corner. Basket pool. Thompson against James. They set the pick. Here's Looney. That's in. Coming off the assist from Thompson. A, a team first player. When Thompson notices one of his guys is uncovered, he is willing to get it to him. Now, here's Lillard. We've got 128 left to play in the final quarter. Autobio with the bucket. That's simply an outstanding play, working the size mismatch right at the rim. From Damian Lillard. And here's Thompson. Pass to Poole. Back to Thompson. Three pointer. It's hauled in by Bam Adebayo. Adebayo's got his fifth rebound in this one. And he hits it and gets hacked on the play. A three-point possibility if he can convert the free throw. Oh, a fearless play by Mitchell. Sinks his shot while being fouled, and now he'll get to the line. And a new group getting ready for Miami. Jokic has checked in for Adebayo. Kevin Durant comes in for Giannis Antetokounmpo. Murray's checked in for James. And Gordon subbed in for Lillard. One oh seven left in the fourth quarter. Jerome passes to Green to the middle. Here's Kaminga, and it's Durant with the rebound. Forty-one seconds left in the fourth quarter. Good on the shot. And credit the whole team. It was a focused, concerted effort to put this one away. Yeah, what a time to put the hammer down. Any hope of a comeback diminished. There's 39 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Here's Jerome. Green with the ball. Inside. Here's Kaminga. And that one hits back iron. And so it's Murray who brings the ball up for Miami. They lead by the biggest margin of the game, 25. And the rejection by Iguodala. Oh, the steady defensive hand of Iguodala. Exceptional at reading shooters and stifling. And a bit of a battle here for the ball. The official signals a jump ball here. And now let's take a look again at that incredible rejection. Such great timing. Defensive awareness, too. When you have to face a defender that can reject you like this, it certainly can change your approach. 
Here's Jerome. And so Miami takes this one by a big margin. This game may not have been the most exciting we've ever seen, but you have to appreciate just what a clinical performance they put on. I know their fans appreciated it, and we saw at times just stretches of excellent defense. Potency from an offensive standpoint as well. They, they were pretty much dominant. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Clark Kellogg, Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan along with our terrific 2K Sports crew thanking you for tuning in. We'll see you next time.